Hold on. Ain't you supposed to be a fire emblem? Before we get started with this video, give it a thumbs up, boy. Let's get it over 500 likes, boy. All right, couple of dope Nintendo Switch news items we're going to talk about in this video. But first, Nintendo on Twitter, they ran a poll of their online services. More features, more fun, more games. Well... It seems Nintendo fans aren't having too much fun. They ask on Twitter, do you prefer to play single player or multiplayer games on your Nintendo Switch system? And the results are very telling. 73% said that they prefer playing single player, while only 27% said they prefer online multiplayer and when you read the comments, you realize why the numbers are so skewed. A lot of people are responding, I'd rather play by myself than use your online, your garbage online services. They're saying, we're waiting for Nintendo to give us better online services and then we'll consider paying for your online services, playing on your online services too. Now. <coughs> A lot of the comments said too that you're pay we're paying $20, but it's not even worth the $20. Better off with just having free services. What's the point of having a friend list if you can't message your friends and let them know, hey, hop in my Smash lobby. All you know is that they're online, you're online in Smash, but there's no communication beyond that. And so Nintendo knows that they need to improve their online services. And I really think they're doing, Nintendo just doesn't do stuff without a reason. I think they're doing this on Twitter, taking this poll, gathering this information, collecting it from fans to see how they can better improve their online services. Do I think we're going to get better services from Nintendo? Yes. Every system, uh, most systems, what they started off with isn't usually what they end up with with online services. I'm thinking of the Xbox 360. The Xbox 360 evolved. I got paint all over my hands. I was painting today. The Xbox 360 evolved and what the Xbox Live started on the Xbox 360 isn't the same service that the console ended up with. Even PlayStation, the PlayStation um, Now, PlayStation Plus, um, it started off bare bones and they improved on it. So I'm giving Nintendo some time to improve, but hopefully, hopefully, we can get messaging, basic things, bro. Y'all know what this gift means. If you are, have been watching my videos on Nintendo and their online services, you already know what horse I've been beating to death. Achievements. All right, so I found that interesting. We'll see what unfolds with Nintendo's online services, but I definitely got you covered. Anything news, any breaking news with Nintendo and their online services, we're gonna talk about it right here. The next news item. <laughs> Talking about online services. Let's go, 2K. Let's go, Nintendo. NBA 2K20 on the Switch. We'll be getting a demo this year, two weeks before the game drops. Ooh! Bro, every year, that is the past two years, it's been on the Switch, Xbox uh, One, and the PlayStation 4. They've gotten demos, and the Switch version, we just get it at launch. Usually, it's when they're trying to hide something, like, hey, <coughs> we don't want to try to touch the Switch version yet. The fact that they're giving us a demo on the Switch this year means some drastic improvements have been made. My pet peeve, I play the game primarily online. It's the lag, talking about online services again. Hopefully they've improved the lag on the Switch, 
but lit 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 NBA 2K on the Switch. We're getting a demo August 21st, two weeks before the game drops. Day one on the Switch. Can't wait. Can't. Hey, the grind is going to be real in 2K on the Switch this year, boy. All right, next news item. Fire Emblem. Fire Emblem, the reviews are coming in and so far, so good. Right now on Metacritic, I believe the game is standing over a 93 on Metacritic right now. Um, it's just scoring pretty good. It's scoring, um, scoring pretty good. It's getting great reviews all around. The one review that sticks out to me is... The IGN review. Um, I believe IGN gave it. Oh, actually, right now, I take that back. Right now, it's standing at an 87 on Metacritic. Uh, 88, it goes up. Metacritic is just, <laughs> it's constantly changing. And so, Fire Emblem Three Houses right now is at an 88. An 88 on Metacritic. IGN, I believe IGN gave it a 95. A real high score, and so um, it's getting critical, gr critically great reviews. Yeah, nine. I said a 95, a 9.5 for IGN, meaning the game is amazing. Every about everything about this game looks dope. Tonight at midnight, we're gonna be playing that Fire Emblem boy. We're gonna be streaming it right here on the YouTube. We're gonna be playing Fire Emblem Three Houses. Can't wait. I already picked my house. Golden Deer, boy. We going with the House of Baratheon. Boy, Game of Thrones. And so, can't wait, can't wait, can't wait to play Fire Emblem's Three Houses tonight. Already got it preloaded. This next news item, I thought this was pretty dope. I had to share this. There is. What are you looking at right now? This is a gaming machine of every gamer's dream. It is... A PC, Xbox One, PlayStation 4, and Nintendo Switch all crammed into one gaming machine. The ultimate game. Just imagine, you turn on your machine and you can play everything. That's what um, this company made. It's called... Uh, the big O and Origin. Um, Origin, I can't. I think PC uh, made it. It's called the big O, but it's not for sale. Um, I think they just made it out of fan service. I think to celebrate 10 year anniversary of the company or something like that. But it looks pretty dope, bro. Just about, bro. If I had one of these, uh, well, this, <laughs> the next thing is this generation about to be over. So you better get an Xbox Scarlet and a PlayStation 5 up in there. But I thought this was pretty lit. That's dope, dope, dope. All right, let's go on. I meant to talk about this yesterday, but I got busy, got tied up, didn't talk about it. Nintendo has come out with an official statement. That lawsuit will make you change your actions. Nintendo is fixing Joy-Cons for free. Give us free. That's right. If you have any issues with your Joy-Cons, you turn it into Nintendo. Even if the warranty's been up, they're not asking any questions. They're doing this to save face. But there's a stickler. I'm hearing now. There's new news. There's new news that um, it's not going to be for every region. In the U.S., they'll fix it for free. I believe in Europe, it's not for free. And so you make sure you check your region where you live for the Joy-Con trade-in um, to get your Joy-Con, bruh. And the last news item, I thought this was pretty lit. To celebrate Disney Sum Sum Festival releasing on October 10th in Japan. In Japan, you can get a Disney-themed Nintendo Switch. This looks lit. The home button has a Mickey Mouse face, bro. My kids would eat this up, bro. They would love these. At least give us um, sell the Joy-Con separate. But I thought this was pretty dope, so I just wanted to share it. All right, before I head out, I have to let you guys know. Shout out to the newest Twitch sub. I'm giving away a Nintendo Switch Lite. Shout out to one of the sponsors, Scoobs, for sponsoring it. 
in September, September 1st, I'm going to be announcing the give no September 2nd, September 2nd. I'm going to be announcing the giveaway winner for a Nintendo Switch 2 a lucky member of the OGC. OGC is the Obi-Wan Plays Gaming Championships. That's a community that I've created for the dudes that support me either through a Twitch sub, becoming a YouTube member right here on YouTube. The join button is right below this video or becoming a sponsor on Patreon. Either way, you get invited to our private gaming Discord. The link's in that description at the bottom. And I just game with the sponsors every day. Dope gaming community. And if you have Twitch Prime, you get in for free you could just subscribe and it's no cost to you but you still be supporting me um through twitch prime so that's it for this video what do you guys think about everything we discussed sound off in the comment section below i want to know but before you go bro click that subscribe button stay up to date all things nintendo we out boy Oh, Reggie, please <laughs> <of me. laughs> This dude's shirt is tight.